What's up guys, it's Lou from Unbox Therapy and today we're taking a look at an all-terrain solar-powered wireless sound system from the folks at Eaton. This is called the Rugged Ruckus and it gives you a splash-proof Bluetooth enabled speaker system for connecting your wireless devices so you can stream music to it in environments where you wouldn't want to damage some other type of boombox. This also has a solar panel built in which is pretty unique and you can recharge the device using just just the solar panel. In fact, it will charge in less than five hours if it's in direct sunlight. And then you can use it also sort of as a backup battery because you can charge things like your smartphone via a USB port right on the system. So it's a multifunction sort of Swiss army knife of Bluetooth speakers. In terms of specs, it's capable of grabbing a full charge in direct sunlight in five hours using just the solar panel. If you need to speed up that process, you can recharge it over USB and cut that in half to about two and a half hours with a full charge it's capable of eight plus hours of music playtime. but since you're probably using this outside in the sun it will likely be charging while you're using it so you probably will never have to worry about running out of battery the rugged ruckus is only 1.2 pounds so it's incredibly portable as a sound system as a boombox but also as a heavy duty battery backup and that's what this usb cable is for to recharge the device or to recharge your your other USB devices like mobile phones, MP3 players, etc. Does anybody have MP3 players anymore? You've got a little bit of paperwork included and that's about it in terms of what's inside the box. You have the giant solar panel which dominates the top of the rugged ruckus and the speakers are on the front side. I will give you a sound test as the video moves forward so definitely stick around for that. As I mentioned earlier, it is water resistant and they've achieved that by covering up most of the inputs and outputs or all of them, all the ports with a rubberized sort of flap that you have to remove to get access to them. The Rugged Ruckus does support analog audio devices through the use of an auxiliary jack, which is essentially a headphone jack. So if your device doesn't support Bluetooth or you don't want to use Bluetooth streaming, you still have access to these speakers using a standard audio cable. There is a fairly bright light as well, which you can click on the back here to, I suppose, identify the fact that the port is active and that you're using it. Uh, maybe if you don't want to drain battery or something, you can remember a little bit easier by turning the lights off. Um, you've also got a USB port here. As I said before, this is going to be used to charge your devices. And once again, there's a, a light there and a, a switch in order to identify the fact that you are charging so you don't waste battery when you don't want to. Okay, so it's time for the grand finale. I've got the Zoom H2N audio recorder set up in front of of the rugged ruckus and you guys can get a sense for how it sounds <laughs> So there you have it, some pretty impressive performance out of such a small unit, especially one that can get its power from the sun. It's pretty tough to portray to you through a video like this how it sounds in person because you're using headphones or the speakers on your iPad or laptop or something like that. But trust me, it is impressive for such a small unit and I definitely recommend checking it out. Anyways, if you guys are interested in pricing and availability on the Rugged Ruckus, I will put a link down in the description. If you enjoyed this content, please remember to leave a thumbs up down below. Thanks as always for watching and I'll catch you on the next episode later.